LaShawn Sugar Ray Marston grew up at the Queensbridge houses just a few blocks away. He says he's camping out here for a cause. So you want people sitting in this yeah, chair? Of course. I want people to sit down and have a conversation with me. Let's talk about the neighborhood. He's pitching a tent and a proposal to the city on how he would convert this city building that spans almost an entire city block into a community hub. You know, it's a process, it's a process, it's a process, but young people are losing their lives down the block. Marston, a member of the Western Queens Community Land Trust, a Queens nonprofit of small business owners, activists, and artists, says he's tired and frustrated with what he calls the tale of two Long Island cities. We will create jobs, we will get young people off the street. Marston says this note from the city's sanitation department was attached to a nearby poll and that he has to be out by March 11th. But he wants to stay. It's not everyone agrees with him. You're, you think that, that, that this should stay for the city? Yes and uh, maybe they'll provide another space for the community. I wonder who was inside the tent. We want to do a rooftop farm, we want to do a co-op community kitchen. I'm so for your cause, I hope you get it. And a spokesperson for the New York City DOE tells PIX11 News, quote, there are over 1,200 employees working out of the building, supporting school facilities, transportation, food service, the public schools athletic league, and many other departments. That, quote, the building has also served as a hub for COVID-19 equipment and other PPE and that quote there are no current additional plans for the building. Marston admits it gets cold at night. He has extra socks and it's not easy. He's right next to a food cart but he hopes he's sending a clear message. It makes most people just move in love. And Marston says he'll be here till March 14th. That's his 39th birthday. If you want to follow his journey or want more information about the group that he's a member of, just go to my Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, and now TikTok at Monica Morales TV, or just scan the QR code right here, and we'll link you there.